Hello, today I'll be taking you through a concept in Microsoft Access uh, that sometimes you may uh, require to set custom uh, currency. Uh, by default, Microsoft Access will assign uh, US dollar and uh, you may need to change that US dollar to custom currency, e.g. I would like to change to Kenya shillings for my country. And therefore, the symbol is KSHS. On the other hand, I would wish to show you how to set decimal places. For instance, uh, you want a value to be something like uh, Kenya shillings uh, 2300 point uh, decimal places. Therefore, if you need uh, your work to be something of the sort, then uh, definitely you need to uh, cast out to do the following to achieve the following objectives. That is, you set the decimal places, you also uh, set the currency symbol. Uh, before we continue, remember to subscribe. Uh, give me that subscription, it will help me a lot. Then from there we can now proceed to our lesson. Uh, at this point, I have uh, a field called fees paid, a field called uh, fees payable, and by default you can see the currency is US dollar and there is no decimal prices. Therefore basically we can start uh, uh, with uh, uh, seeing how you set the decimal prices. Therefore, how do you set the decimal prices? What you do, you go to design view, then you identify the field. Like now, I want uh, this field, uh, fee speed to have two decimal prices. Therefore, I click, then go down to the field properties. Uh, in the field properties, I go to decimal, then assign two. Uh, then I go back to the next field, that is the fees payable. I go to the decimal uh, point, that is in the field properties, I set 2. I also go to balance, I go to decimal prices, I also set 2. Then I save my work. When I now run the table, you will see that uh, the feeds, uh, we have assigned now the, the two decimal places. Then uh, let's proceed to our next objective. Uh, that is um, our next objective is uh, setting a custom uh, currency. Therefore, let's see how you set a currency currency from US dollar to Kenya shillings. Therefore, basically you just go to control panel. You go to the control panel. Then uh, once the control panel opens. You go to uh, croc, croc and uh, legion. Then you go to change date, time, number, formats. Now in this dialog box, uh, this one, you go to additional settings. Then you get to see the tabs up there. Therefore you go to currency. Then you get, you have the currency symbol as US dollar. Now this is the point you type your custom uh, currency. Then you click on apply. You also click on OK, apply again, OK. Then you can now go back to our database. We close this table and then reopen it. OK, it has not yet set. Now we just go back again to confirm that uh, that one has been set therefore I go back to just for confirmation okay you go to currency this is Kenya shillings We apply that one, okay. Good. Therefore, now when you go to back to your database, you realize that uh, Kenya shillings symbol 
has been assigned. And therefore, if I just even go to another table and uh, can add registration fee and add a currency symbol, currency, and then save, uh, and then go and try to feed some cash there. It will automatically now take the the default uh, the, the default Kenya shillings. Therefore, uh, that's how you uh, achieve those two very important objectives: uh, setting a currency, a custom currency, and also setting uh, decimal prices. Therefore, thank you very much for watching. Always remember to give.